Hey everyone, this is take three. I have turned off absolutely everything in my house because for some reason I'm getting this horrible background sound. So I'm going to make this fast. Um, I have an open collaboration that I am doing with Christy over at Meta Studios, Malia at Lovely Malia here on YouTube. And it is called Trashy to Treasures. It is an open collaboration. Anyone can join it. We just ask that you put the um, hashtag Trashy to Treasures in your title and that you mention the other channels that are participating. Just, you know, make a little note. Write it down when you do your video. Mention the channels. Um, several others have signed up at the beginning, but... I don't think they're still doing it. You know, there's always a clash of personalities when others join in and they don't like the ideas or something. I don't know. I don't have time for that. But this is my June Trashy to Treasure. <coughs> Excuse me. Anyway. I think about three years ago, I was doing the shadow boxes with my ancestors' pictures and different little memorabilia of them. They're all packed away now. Um, I had been asked to show them. I never got around to doing the videos on them. You know, life is busy. It really is. And, you know, it's not a thing that I do intentionally when somebody says, Oh, will you show that? I don't deliberately not show it. It's just life is busy. As you all know, I have had some serious health setbacks the last few years. So, I got this shadow box at a thrift store for like $3 or something. I don't know. Anytime I see a shadow box, I grab it. Regardless of the price. Yard sales, thrift store, wherever I am, I grab it try to get the used ones and the older ones because I just think they have more character. It is, the backing is an old vintage dually. And over top of that I have a very light blue lace from um, Amore Fabrics shop on Etsy. I purchased some vintage letters and envelopes and um, postcards from eBay. And I believe this is German. I'm almost positive this is Germany. And my glasses were stolen when my purse was, so I can tell you what the postmark is. But this is a vintage postcard with this lovely lady on it. And she's holding a little white flower bouquet with a church in the background. I'm going to assume this is her wedding day. Because my grandmother's wedding picture is actually in a black dress. I think she might have known something at the time, but hey, who's the judge? So I put the Tim Holtz little white flower bundle down here to match her flower bundle. And then I have the Battenberg heart. And I put some of the blue lace on that and then put a white cameo. And the reason for using the blue in here was these little flowers I really wanted to put in here. And they had these two have a blue center. So I needed something to make that blue stand out. But they're simple to make. They're easy. They're fast. And they are a beautiful decoration for around the house. So here is an idea for you to... You see shadow boxes in your thrift stores. Pick them up. All these cabinet cards and stuff you've been buying in these YouTube sales. And these old letters or envelopes. Use them. Use them to decorate your house because it's vintage, it looks antique, and it's, you know, it's really nice. I love these things. So, this is going down to um, Defy, which is the Disabled Artist Foundation, Incorporate, Incorporation, because they have um, an auction the second Saturday of every month on CARE. Hearts channel here on YouTube and it's H-A-R-T and um, it's a fundraiser 
I am the administrator for the Wings of the Pie. I am not a disabled artist. As many people keep asking me, no, I'm not. I am a donor. Um, and I do run the new Facebook group, The Wings of the Phi, which is separate from the Angels. The Angels group makes mostly things for the hardest, but sometimes for the auctions. Um, the Angels group is more focused on the disabled artists getting supplies and stuff for them. The Wings of the Fly is more focused on coming up with ideas, doing fundraisers, uh, making things that they can sell for fundraisers, and, you know, just supporting them in how they need, to, however they need us. You know, if they say, hey, can you do such and such, you know, two or three of us get together and we'll get it done. Hopefully. Most of the time. Well, we try. <laughs> anyway, we're new. We're still, you know, getting our feet wet. So, if you're interested in being a part of the Wings of the Fi, we are on Facebook. We are a closed group. But there is a form you fill out to join. Um, as long as you're willing to put in the work, that's it. You're not getting anything back. I mean, there's no freebies, there's no once a month kit, there's no nothing. Um, there's talk of doing a once a month kit for a membership fee. I'm of the type that I don't need to get anything back. You know, if, if you want to be charitable, you're going to be charitable. If you're in it to get something out of it, you're going to leave it. So, no before going in. You're not getting anything. It's a giving. So, you know, if you have a given heart, if you are able to help, um, you know, we don't expect anybody to do things that is above their budget. But we do appreciate help from others and, you know, brainstorming together or doing lives crafting for a cause together and you know, on each other's channels and, you know, just bring awareness to the Disabled Artist Foundation and help with fundraising for the auctions. So, with that said, this is my June Trash to Treasure. It's all old stuff. It's all recycled, including the box. Well, the lace I just got in kit. Actually, I did just buy the lace a couple of months ago. But she recycled it. She dyed laces. I think it's curtains or something. But anyway, it was pretty. So it went in here. And I've got some old, you know, doilies in here. And it's just a shadow box. And they're great decor for your home. I had thought about putting a little journal like I got in an estate selling here. But I ran out of room. So maybe that'll be for another option. Okay, we'll see you guys soon. I rambled enough and my throat hurts. Bye.